Hello and welcome friends of our homestead. In our this week's video I like to introduce you my newest tool that I bought for the farm and it's hopefully a game changer for the farm in the future. We have lots of projects that have to be finished. One of the projects is putting siding on the wall from the shop and that's a lot of siding. I have to put siding on the woodshed Siding have to be on the goat barn we built last year. To make it nice, comfortable and wind tight for these guys. And these guys. And I definitely have to finish the vinyl siding on the house, which is very important, not just for me, for my wife too. Happy wife, happy life, makes my life easier, if it's done. We built our house four years ago, it's definitely time to do it so soon as possible and it looks way better if it looks like this. There are two different ways to do it. If you are young enough and everything heals pretty fast, you can do it the old school way like this. I'm not so young anymore, nothing heals fast and I always run out on time, so I like to try the faster way. That's why I bought this tool. But let me say one thing up front, I am not sponsored by Bostage or paid for this advertisement, I just want to find a way to make it easier and faster for me and for you guys to install vinyl siding. But in the case you are interested in the staple gun, I put the link for you in the description down below. It is an affiliate link from Amazon, I only get paid a little money from Amazon if you use this link to buy the staple gun or something else. It definitely would help us to make future projects real for you. The Bostitch staple gun 651S5 comes together with the vinyl siding adapter VSA5 in the box. I also bought an extra light and very flexible polymer hose which should make the work on the staging or on the ladder very easy. The staple gun has a foldable hook on the handle with which you easy can hang it on a ladder, scaffolding or your pants and when you don't need it, simply leave it folded up. She comes with a male quick coupler air hose adapter which should fit to every regular air hose. The quick coupler female is already installed, so it's plug and play. And you don't need any Teflon tape to put it on. It is a 16 gauge staple gun for 7 16 wide staples and up to 2 inch long. We use 1 inch long staples. Because of I don't want that they stick too far out at the inside of the building and maybe hurt the goats. She has a quick release mechanism that holds the staple pusher in the back. So you can easily load the staples into the gun without taking care of the spring. The 
factory fitted adapter is for flat surfaces and shoots the staples flush to the surface. By adjusting these adapters you can set the penetration depth. Both of the adapters, the original one and the VSA5 adapters are mounted with an Allen key bolt. The only thing I missed at that kit is an Allen key wrench that fits into that bolt so you have to use your own and you need a 4mm Allen key wrench to remove or to change the adapters. The pattern makes the adjustment very simple and easy. We post every Sunday a new video here on our YouTube channel. If you like our videos and what we do, please subscribe for our channel, hit only the button in the lower right corner. It costs you nothing, hurts nobody and really helps us a lot. That's the vinyl siding adapter with two little knobs on one side and the original one without knobs. And they have both pattern at the inside. first setup I tried was too deep, so it shoots the staple too deep into the lumber. I adjusted the adapter a little more out. And the result was close to perfect. Staple gun comes with a single or with a multiple shot switch. You can only change the setup if you remove that little spring splint. Be careful if you move that splint out because it's very very tiny and if it's gone it's gone and it's hard to find it back again and there's only one in the kit that comes with the gun. After you remove the splint you have to push from the back side and then you can turn the switch to change the setup to multiple shots. Put the splint back in and it's ready to use with multiple shots. Connect the air and let's go. I like to use it with single shots. I think it's safer and easier for me to use it this way. You should always try to shoot the staple in the middle of the hole, only then can the vinyl siding move in both directions if the sun shines through it or if it gets too cold. I'm sure with a little training it will work. But the important thing is, the vinyl siding can move right now in both directions. And the staples don't stick out at the inside. I'm sure that tool is worth the money. 
That's it for this week's video, thanks guys for watching it. If you want to support us a little, you can buy us a coffee, I put the link for you in the description down below. And if you like our videos, hit the subscribe button, leave the thumb up for us and don't forget to hit the button for the notification bell. And we see us next week. That's it for this week's video, thanks guys for watching it, if you like our videos and what we do, don't forget to subscribe for our channel, leave a thumb up for us, hit that button. That's it for this week's video, thanks guys for watching it, if you want to support us a little, you can buy us a coffee, I put the link for you in the description down below. <coughs> That's it for this week's video, thanks guys for watching it, if you want to support us a little, you can buy us a coffee, I put the link for you in the description down below. <coughs> That's it for this week's video, thanks guys for watching it, if you want to support us a little, I can buy you me a coffee. The factory fitted adapter is for flat surfaces and shoots the staple flush to the surface. By adjusting these adapters you can set the penetration drag. Both adapters, both adapters, the original factory mounted adapter and the VH. Uh, Both adapters, the original one and the VSA5 vinyl siding adapter are mounted with that hex head uh, Allen key screw bolt. Both adapters are mounted with that Allen key hex head. A pattern makes the adjustment very easy. That's the vinyl siding adapter with two little That's the vinyl siding adapter with two little knobs on one side and a reef. And the original And the original one without And the original one without knobs.